Hey, how's it going folks? ET here with another iMovie tutorial. In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to import your media from an SD card or any kind of memory card, whatever they name them these days. All right, let's get into it. Alrighty, we're going to create a new project here by clicking Create New. We're going to click on Movie. And now we have no media in here. And we do not have an SD card in my card reader on my Mac Mini here. So let's go ahead and push this in. So Mac OS and iMovie automatically pull up this importer here and this will allow you to actually pull in the clips that you haven't pulled in before. So this import functionality does have some smarts behind it. If you'll notice there's only three images here but actually on my SD card, let me go ahead and pull this up in the finder itself. I have more pictures and more clips, okay? So what you're gonna do is if you need everything that's on the card itself, and you've already imported previously, you're going to have to go up to the corner here and deselect hide imported. That way you can see everything. And you will have a line at the bottom that signifies which clips or which parts of the clips you've actually imported. But for this tutorial, let's go ahead and import everything. You can lasso it by holding down the mouse or the trackpad and selecting everything. You can do one at a time. You can click on one and hold shift and it'll actually highlight all of them. So let's go ahead and just import all of them. Okay, you'll notice there's a little circle here, a little hourglass. That's basically telling you, hey, it's still importing. So it's not quite ready for prime time for using, okay? The second way to import media from an SD card if it doesn't pop up is to go to the file menu at the top here. Go to import media. And then you're gonna go ahead and just locate the SD card here. And you can do the same. Sometimes you'll have hidden clips, sometimes you won't. Sometimes you'll just want videos. Sometimes you'll want only photos, sometimes you want all. Let's go ahead and close that. The last way to import it is the old brute force method, which I kind of don't really recommend, is to grab the SD card itself, dig into the file structure and just highlight everything and then drag it into the media pool here, the My Media area. All right, well I think that's it for today's tutorial. As usual, don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up and all that jazz. If you have any questions, put them in the comments below. And we'll talk to you in the next video. Peace and aloha.